Please welcome Lauren Lanning. Hi, everybody. It's great to be here today. And we're showing a glimpse of Oddworld Soulstorm. It's a brand new game in the Oddworld series. And in Soulstorm, we wanted to break new ground. Uh, big visual and cinematic leaps were important to us. And so as a storyteller, I need to stay focused on the things that bring that narrative to life. And in this case, this is where Unity's breadth of real-time lighting and technologies and the amazing teams working with us around the world are making this possible. So today, we're showing you a sneak peek of a cinematic from the game that demonstrates some of Unity's latest rendering techniques. Then, when that's done, Benny Terry, the executive producing partner on the project, is going to show you how Unity has elevated the graphical quality of Oddworld Soulstorm. Thank you. I think you need to see this. <laughs> Hobie, it's the end of the line, Al. It's an honor to be here with you today. Building our cinematics is a global endeavor. Through Unity, our teams of talented creatives and engineers are collaborating in real time. When you are as distributed in, a, in Unity as we are, the tools are a critical component in how we produce economy CG. Unity provides a sandbox of powerful cinematic tools to choreograph the narrative and polish our visuals, called timeline and post-process stack. In our scene breakdown, the process starts simple, but very quickly grows in complexity. In-engine parallel workflow is the key to reducing production costs and increasing the quality of CG that we produce. Instead of waiting hours to render, our iteration speed from review to direct and approval happens in real time. For Oddworld, the richness in our visuals and imagery, imagery is very important to us as creatives. When we started Soulstorm three years ago, the team focused on how far we could elevate that bar. Utilizing the built-in renderer, which is still used in many components of our production today, our characters like the Shaman have significantly improved since our last IP, New and Tasty. As a team, we aspire to reach further. Built-in rendering, while great, wasn't designed for the types of heavy graphical complexity and realism that our creative director had envisioned for the cinematics. The team wanted more control to refine the visuals and give the shaman that stylized Oddworld look. High definition rendering pipeline in Unity 2019 is a huge leap in graphical realism and ease of use. In our split screen tests, the differences are immediately apparent. The shaman doesn't feel so flat and washed out. The way light behaves while interacting with the shaman's skin and features is more physically accurate. We're able to color grade the image in engine and in real time, which gives our visual a more cinematic, right out of the box look. But light doesn't just touch the surface, it goes deeper, right? Scattering before it returns back to your eye. HDRP plus subsurface scattering was the solution that we gave for the shaman to give that rich Oddworld style. We explored these opportunities to make our characters feel like they were a part of you. The work that Unity has done to mature its rendering technology is outstanding. Please follow us at oddworld.com. Thank you so much. Thank you. 